Wonderful thing you're doing yeah. for yourself, Nikki. You finished your tuna melt, and now you're eating a chocolate bar. You're a regular. A with, <laughs> yeah. with, what are you drinking? Is that just water? Is it just purple water? Purple water. Is it purple water. It is purple, purple water. Well, what is that like a crystal light from the sewer? Well. From the sewer. <laughs> yep. He got that from the bathtub. <laughs> oh, my vanity broke. It did. Yeah. Not my emotion. Uh, my vanity, like my. Emotional vanity, my yeah, that's not in my thinking. bathroom, no, my actual vanity. Oh, okay. oh, I have sorry. to replace it. It's yeah. a thing. I keep telling people. <laughs> I told Nikki three times, and he said to me, "Goes this way." He goes, "What do you have autism?" He told me like three times. I think I'm gonna keep hearing that until it gets fixed. Yeah. And the thing is, he's the one who knows how to fix things. Yeah, so it's yeah. like. I think it's his way of just letting people know, like, hey, I know how to fix things. No, but it's, I'm not going to tell every. I'm not going to stop until I let everybody know. It's, until a, it's fixed. my reminder to myself so. to bring it up. Like, I mm-hmm. have to say it. You got to keep loud. saying it so that mm. you I can remember. get yourself to do it. Maybe I'll start telling yeah. you. Yeah. Hey, your vanity's broke. Yeah, your vanity's broke. <laughs> Maybe I'll be your personal sticky note. Yeah. I'll call you tomorrow. I'll let you know. Yeah. Hey, your vanity's broke. Yeah. Like, I know. I know. When I, I go into my own bathroom and I see it, I'm like, my vanity's mm-hmm. broken. And then all of a sudden, like, I'm getting calls. Hey, your vanity's broken. Yeah. It's like I wonder if that would work for like, like the power of suggestion working for your own hair. Like if you go to bed, and you're like, my hair needs to grow. <laughs> like before you go to bed, you're like, oh. I need to grow my hair. I need you to grow my hair. My hair needs to grow. And you wake up and you're like, your follicles get back into business. Oh, I wish that could work. Mm-hmm. They don't want to have to pay all this money down the road. Yeah, tell me about it. Yeah, I but... knew, I knew from a young age that my hair was gonna fall out. I'm fully coming to terms with the fact that I'm like gonna buzz it within the next. Year yeah, so. you've been. Uh, it's good that you have accepted that yeah. that is going to happen. Mm-hmm. Just like my death at the at the, you know, in the next few years. <laughs> yeah, few years. Yeah, 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 I'm gonna top off at a, at a nice young age. You're gonna get too old. Oh, yeah, I don't want to. You know, you can't keep the party going forever. Speaking of party, let's just get this out of the way yeah, right yeah, now. Yeah. Uh, Nikki, Nikki got, got engaged. engaged. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 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 Anyway. Moving on. Chris, what's your favorite board game? Ooh. I'll tell you my least favorite. Uh, oh, let's do that. Least, oh, least favorite. Oh, wait. Ooh, good I, one. I just realized, too. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. I went yesterday with... Uh, I have a story. Okay. Yeah. It ends with the board game, so we'll go back on track yeah, with the board game. Uh, but we better get back on track. We will. We will. Okay, good, good, good. So, um, yesterday... Uh-huh. Um... I was, I don't know how to start the story, actually. <laughs> so, so board games. So, so yesterday, <laughs> yeah. I said to my my parents, uh, I need to go to the supermarket. And they said, great, we were just going to go too. We'll stop by in 10 minutes. I said, great, I'll be there. They said, okay, um, but first we're going to go have lunch. I said, that, that wasn't part of the plans. I'm not that hungry. Right. Mm-hmm. They're like, well, can you fit something in? I said, sure, why not? So I sit with them for an hour. Make room in my day. Is this where we just were? No, somewhere else. Okay. Um, we go, have lunch. Mm. People looking at my watch. My mom's like, did you have plans? I'm like, kind of. I'm like, I'm a grown man now. I don't live with you anymore. <laughs> I don't want to sound rude. But I'm like, no, no, no. You know, like, I'm enjoying this. You know, this is good. This is like old times, yeah. you know? Yeah. So then we eventually go to one place. Which was short, which is the other point, one place I wanted to go. Then we go to the supermarket. Obviously, we're not sponsored by any of these places, so we can't say any names. I didn't no. want to. You the know, Fresca it's, Mart. It's not important. And then we get to Flip's Mart. the supermarket. Right. The big supermarket. But my father goes, um, no, before we get to the supermarket, I'm too low on gas. We have to – not gas. We have to stop off before we go to the supermarket. I need to charge my electric vehicle for 20 minutes. Okay. 20 minutes? You just put uh, you just put an hour in front of me and now mm-hmm. another 20 minutes. Another 20. He goes, an hour 20. He goes, you can sit in the car with me or I can drop you and your mom off at the, the market. Well, Super. I'll say the name. I put you and your mom at Target okay. yeah. to walk around. Uh-huh. Yeah. I go, oh, man. I guess. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you. It's worse places to be dropped. I know, but Wait, not- but that's not where you were going, though. No. Okay. Mm-hmm. 
Well, I mean, that's where that's where we ended up. I mean, I, no, I had plans to go with to meet somebody somewhere. I else. had plans to meet somebody basically from work to just you know just fraternize and do something. But I wound up canceling that because I said I'm not going to be able to meet you today. Mm-hmm. Another time, my friend. Were they okay with that? He said, "Sure, don't worry about. It. I'm already there." Okay. I I counted on you not being able to make it. He said, "Don't worry. There's nothing going on over here anyway." Got I said, "That's fine." But the thing is, the the fun thing fun thing happened where, you know, anytime you spend time with your mom, it's craziness, madness. I had an panic, anxiety attack. Yeah, I had to just walk away from her, walk up and down another aisle. Yeah, I had to just stand still, look down at the ground. But the fun thing that came out of it, mm-hmm. my what my mom's purchase was, mm-hmm. she got the game Clue. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Good game. She said, you know what? I'm going to get this game of Clue. You know why? Good I game. was playing Scrabble the other day with your father on on the uh, the TV, on the on the console game. Uh-huh. Apparently, she knows how to work a, a video game console. <laughs> she said, and a question came up about Clue. And she goes, A question me. during Scrabble? Yeah. She said, and me and Paul know stuff about Clue, like rooms and stuff, and your father knows nothing about Clue. And she goes, well, you know what? I'm going to actually buy the game Clue, and he's going to learn. Yeah. So she's like, let's educate your father about Clue. The fun thing that I like about board games is that you can turn any board game into a drinking game. Mm. You can. Mm -hmm. Like um, Apples to Apples. Mm -hmm. How do you do that? We used to do uh, the winner and the loser. So you know how what the, you pick the whichever card is the uh, the number one, like whatever you think fits the the green card the best. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then you pick whichever one you think is the worst card, mm-hmm. and whoever is that card. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So are we considering? What is your favorite board game? But are we considering? Uh. uh... <laughs> Board games to be any kind of like uh, box game that doesn't have a board. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah There's yeah, card, yeah. card, yeah, card games. games. Card but all those are being considered yeah, 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 in this any kind okay. of game that isn't isn't a screen. Isn't a screen it's game. A screen. So they they've moved some board games to screen. Yeah, too. your mother got yeah. uh, Clue, the actual board game. Yeah. Okay. It was on sale. Okay. Twenty five percent off. So, I like Clue, but it's a little much. I don't know. Not to mention it's, it's, it's old. It's Clue is. Better to play it the proper way with less people. Like I would say, like three maybe. Once three. you have more than three, four. Four. I think four, four is prime. No, you... well, once you have more than than three, then uh, it mean? takes a while to roll the die and then move around the board. Mm-hmm. I think f- four is perfect. Because you, you need competition. You, you need competition, my friend. Well, what we it's did is we, we had it. We had uh, five people playing. Five is too many. Uh, what game are we talking about? Clue. 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 What do you got? Yeah. Sound like me now. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> we had Come five people pay, playing Clue, and it was uh, it. Everyone was getting like they were rolling low numbers. And uh, so everybody just would take tiptoeing, yeah. tiptoeing around the mansion. No one yeah. was getting into any rooms. Yeah. Peek so in. then someone said, "Why don't we just move to the room of our choice and guess? And guess, yeah. and then we We're guess." Until... Clue Junior. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So that's what we did. But I do like Clue. We do have Clue. He had Miss have... Peacock just knocking on doors. Yeah. Hello. How's I people? like going with Colonel Mustard. He's got a nice mustache. Yeah. Colonel, I like Colonel Mustard Plum. in the lavatory. Mm-hmm. I don't think that's one. Is it? Yeah. I like Professor Plum in the in the conservatory. What's the the green room? Not the green room. <laughs> the green room is before a show. No. The green room because he was he was getting ready to go on stage. <laughs> That's not what I yeah. mean. No, what's the the, the one where with all the plants? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah but what's uh, it's not called the green, green room. No, it's called the uh, <laughs> what's the what's it called? The one with the with the greenhouse. Greenhouse. No, but it's, yeah, but it's not called. I think it's the the, the, the conservatory. That's yeah. conservatory. I don't know. It's not called a, a botany room. <laughs> it's not called a, it's a, 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 a the glass house. It's not called a, the the the, gra- the, um, the 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 glass house. The, the don't throw the don't throw stones. Don't throw stones. The greenhouse. It's called conservatory. I think so. I the conservatory was something else. I don't know. Um. Hmm. They got to update clue. 
Hmm. They really? did. No, they but... did. I have a. I had a. I have a clue. That you have. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What is it? Tell I us. Have a clue. I got a clue. <laughs> get a get a clue. I have a clue board. I have a, I have a clue uh, board game. Right. Uh-huh. Yeah, you're right. They do. And I see what you're saying. Like they need to make like the motorcycle guy. Right. No. 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 Okay. But I have it. But the boy, you up. You turn the board over, and it's like murder on the boardwalk. Oh, oh, you mean like move away from just the mansion, right? And it's like a new okay. New I can thing. see that. But I tried playing, and it's it's dumb. It's so stupid. It's like oh, the well, the murder might have happened at the at the cotton candy booth. At the, it's like for teenagers. I don't. Yeah, know. no, it's we don't dumb. Need that yeah. stuff for kids. I just want like a bigger mansion with more rooms and like with more interesting people and like or like in a theater. In a theater. A theater with a green room. A theater with a green room. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Ooh. Murder in the green room. So I like. Uh, What's going on here, Nick? <laughs> <laughs> Nick is so popular. Yeah, he's, he's the most popular. As just like when we put out that poll yeah. a while ago that some might have missed, but some saw. Mm-hmm. Nick was the the favorite. Yep. <laughs> what? Saw. <laughs> uh, Nick was the uh, Nick was most the popular matzo boy. Matzo boy. And everyone I'm, listen, gets, gets into contact. Multiple times I've gone out with Nikki, and this is why Nikki's the most popular matzo boy, is multiple times I've gone out, and um, we, yeah, I was just about to mention that game. Jenga? Yes. But going back to what I was, before we mentioned Jenga, I, uh, multiple times I've gone out with Nikki, and immediately, I'm like, oh, I'm Chris, this is Nikki, and he goes, did you know we have a podcast? Immediately he plugs it. So I'm like, I can't even, he's just right away. So, he's the reason why we have as many viewers as we do. Yeah. It's so, all thanks to you, Nikki. It's all thanks to you. Yeah, and apparently uh, the viewer that I thought was uh, somebody that subscribed is not. So, oh. we got to talk about that. So, we're getting more okay. people than I even thought. So, that's great. This is great. Yeah. And, and people who are watching, keep on watching. We love you. Yeah. Don't forget to yeah. tell your friends. And, and your family. You know. Uh, you know. Neighbors. Neighbors. Go next door. Neighbors, dogs. Off the fence. Listen twice. Three times. I don't think that does anything, but... Yeah. Then you're out. You now. might even catch things... It's, listen, these are like Christopher Nolan movies. You might catch things the second time. <laughs> listen to it backwards. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we put some little hidden messages in reverse. Listen to it sped up. I enjoy a nice game of Jenga. Hmm. Jenga you... stresses me out. Yeah. That's oh, that's point. what I like. <laughs> Stresses no, me out. No, because I always moment. lose. <laughs> <laughs> That's well, the point maybe of the game. You think you're going to win, though. Play to win. Play to win. I so, try to win. Are there, any games, are there any games that you play to lose? Life? Mm, I, I liked like, life when I was a little kid. No, no, I meant to love real life. <laughs> life, I always... Um, <laughs> I've never played life. I would always joke around and try to put uh, two wives in my car. <laughs> That's the thing? Uh, no, it's not a real thing, but... That uh, sounds like Grand Theft Auto. Halfway, halfway <laughs> through the game, they'd be like, Chris, why do you have two wives in your car? And otherwise, you'll... Like, <laughs> Funny, right? But, uh, no, What's that it's... called? Monogamy? Min- uh, Monopoly. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 I think you're confused with a different yeah, game. Yeah, it's it's like a top hat. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No yeah, yeah. monocle on the Monopoly Thimble, guy. that's my favorite. Out? No, right, it's never had it. was it. Oh, that's Mr. Peanut. Mr. Peanut. Mr. Peanut! No, no, it's Mr. Noodle. That's called polygamy. Oh. Um, Penigam- polygamy. <laughs> I said peanut with... Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> if someone's allergic yeah, here, yeah. let's be yeah, careful. Yeah, be careful, Drew. Don't even say the P word. Okay. Because you're allergic. <laughs> yes. So your least favorite board game? Oh. Oh, we, that's I what we were talking about. I thought you said that's what you had. That's what you knew. Isn't that what you, you said? You had it what you knew. <laughs> I was going to say is Jenga, but now I'm thinking about it, and I enjoy a game of Jenga. I don't know what my least favorite board game is. I, who was the one that said that? I said their it. Least I oh, said my least, least favorite. I think my least favorite might be Operation, now that I'm looking at it. But it's all because I can't see it. Yeah. No, no. You can't, you can't get in there. Can't get in there. I mean, I could just... I'll have fun trying, but I'll tell you my least favorite. Go ahead. Shoots and Ladders. I was just yo shoot the ladders. You know how many times I lost because I go back down. Yeah, because of the shoots. And you know what? Even worse when they when they change it to uh, snakes and ladders. No eels and elevators. (laughs) Eels and escalators. escalators. Well, that's the joke one, but I've seen it with the the ladders and the snakes. Yes, that's a kid version. uh, 
Uh, Sponge, Sponge Mexican version. <laughs> Mm, Tex Mex. <laughs> I've seen in the they just the do like a child version. They do yeah. they just do like a like a childish version. Well, I know I know my my in laws have that version. What's what is a shoot anyway? A shoot. It's just like a, a, a shaft. Don't shoot. It's a slide. It's a slide. Oh, okay. it's like a shoot, like a laundry shoot. It's like yeah. ah, you go, you spend all this. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing right now. So just <laughs> bear with me. <laughs> to an accent. You spend hey. all this energy going up the ladder. You get sent down the shoot. Yeah. Oh no, I shoot. No, no, no shooting. I shoot. C H U T E. I know. Hey. I shoot you. Yeah, down the shoot. Yeah, like the I laundry spent bag. I all the time. Go up the ladder. Yeah. And now that I'm up, I roll the dice, and now I go down the shoot. Yep. Is this Gru? No, it's a, it's a new character I'm doing. He's oh. uh, the guy who is perpetually playing shoots and ladders. Yeah. He's he like, owns a laundromat. Yeah. yeah. Mm. That's where yeah, the laundry. Yeah, the laundry goes down the shoot. He goes, uh, no, no, no. So does your success. You get uh, yeah, four quarters for a dollar, and uh, the coins go in the coin shoot, not in the coin ladder. Because everything in his life is shoots and ladders. It's his favorite mm. game. Not us. We hate shoots and ladders. That's my least well, favorite. I don't mind that. Really? Yeah. What's your least favorite board This game? is all chance. It's all chance. There's no no skill whatsoever. No skill. Chance the rapper. Um, <laughs> hmm. My least favorite board game a game that people like what's say, a game that hey, like let's everybody play this and you're and just I'm like, like oh, you oh, gotta yeah. be kidding me it's a game i i can't think of but yeah I have there, one. there is one <laughs> <laughs> i would say what i will say is that when i was younger i always loved when people would play monopoly but then people wouldn't play it the right way and they'd have their own rules you're absolutely right i it's less fun I will literally say, if you're bringing Monopoly, stay home. What? I won't play Monopoly. Stay Mon- home? Stay home. I think said stay on. I, think... I won't play Monopoly. You're not like a Park Place guy? I won't play Monopoly. You don't remember playing it when we were young? At, yeah. At, uh, at someone's house? Yeah. And I remember people like taking... Little Paulie's house? Little Paul and Karen's, Karen's house. house. Yeah. Yeah. And people would literally take... Um, what's it called? The money and hide in their pockets. Yeah, under the table they were trading. Um, well, that's that's real life, buddy. I know. And I was like, uh, uh, uh hello. Like they were selling what's it called? Properties under the table, literally <laughs> under the table, <laughs> literally under the table. Like we were playing in the living room table, and they were trading properties under the table. Well, that that's part of the rules, though. You can make side propositions. Yeah. Can I pick a least favorite board game? Because I don't know how to play it? Yeah, sure. That's the whole... Yeah. Okay. Chess. Well, well maybe we'll teach you after, after and put chess. it on the Patreon. I'll teach you how to play chess. Too many rules. No. no. Not really. Yeah. Not really. You could be... Yeah. You could be knighted. Sir Drew. What do you think of Battleship? Love it. I like Great. Battleship. I love Battleship. You think that one has too many rules? No, I like Battleship. Oh, my god. That's just as good as... That's great as chess. Maybe we should enter you into a chess boxing match. Oh, my goodness. Then you'll really have to you learn. what chess boxing is? No. You know what we should do? Oh, Drew. We should get a couple of pizza boxes. We should build a moat. A moat. Not a boat. A, a moat. A boater moat? <laughs> <laughs> get a couple of pizza boxes, right? I don't know where you're going with this. <laughs> Two pizza boxes. I'm not Two. that good at th- okay. doing things. Set them up. Put our phones on speakerphone. <gasps> Build a big battleship set. Oh, so it's not Very chess good. boxing. It's battleship pizza eating. But, but oh, and we could cut, like, pizza into battleship sizes. Okay. But yeah. then draw with marker. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Battleship. So that the marker can seep into the pizza. That we no, 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 no. <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. No, like you know, or the oh, grid for the back. Oh, for the back of the box. Yeah, for the bottom and yeah, the top. Okay, and then make like you know, cut like uh, Sicilian shapes of. I was not even gonna say pizza, but we can make like pe- we can make the ships out of. Pizza. Oh, he's just said the boxes. The box. Okay, not the pizza. All right, make like cardboard ships. And then I could sit in one end of the house. You sit on the other end of the house. We could be on speakerphone. And we could just yell at each other. Walkie talkie. We can. Wait, why do we have to do it that way? We can't just sit across. It's more from fun. Each other. We could back it's to back. More fun if we like are far from each other and can't see each other. That's the whole point okay. of battleship. You don't see each other. You're and then in we can play big battleship with big pizza boxes, like men. 
I used to cheat on Battleship. It's very easy to cheat on Battleship. You stack your ships. No. No, move them during the game. <laughs> you guys both are horrible. I didn't did cheat. I would never No, cheat. I put all mine next to each other. <laughs> well, maybe I don't. I don't know. Never play with you. What else? Is that your what was your game again? Chess. Oh, chess. Yes, know. chess. Chess. Chess you don't like. Uh, I never like checkers. I like checkers. See, it's easy. I I don't or like rallies. checkers either, but I'd rather. Just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Have you guys ever had um, what? Rally's Burger? Not Rally's, but the other one. Charles, Charles, Charles Jr.? Char- Charles Jr.? Charles Jr.? Who's Charles Jr.? Uh, no. the other I one? don't approve of their advertising campaigns. What about, what's it called? The one from the West Coast. Oh, uh, In-N-Out. In-N-Out. Yes. Have you? When when we went to San Francisco earlier this year, we saw Emma Stone. Yeah. Uh, before, I think it was the day we were leaving. That was our last meal in uh, California was In-N-Out. And? Delicious. Did we talk about it on the No. Um, I just wanted to tell you about Emma Stone and the guy pooping on the sidewalk. That's it. I don't get... Is it pronounced In-N-Out Burger? Or yeah, In-N-Out? Or In-N-Out Burger? <laughs> no, I just don't get it because people go like, oh, it's I'm going to In-N-Out. 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 <laughs> no. no, because I hear people be like, you know like I'm saying? I'm going to like, never mind. I don't want to say, you know, all these places. Like, I'm going to such and such restaurants, right? But this place I always hear it's called In-N-Out Burger. Or is it called? I think you could just. Well, maybe is it the part official of the name. name is well, In-N-Out now it's Burger. now it's just called Duncan. Yeah, that's my. Is it was it part of the original name? They, they're ditching the donuts. All right, let me look. It used to be called Dunkin' Donuts. That's now they're ditching of, the uh, donuts. Yeah. Now literally they're just. Is I it, will never just call it Dunkin'. Me neither. In fact, yeah, I'm calling it Dunkin' Donuts. The working man's coffee yeah. is the full name. America runs on donuts. <laughs> you did like a little. Yeah, I know your internet is so bad right tell now. Me why don't you it. tell us about your internet and why it's so bad right now? Yeah, well, I, I, I don't know, man. Jeez, ask you our, uh, ask not what okay. this um, you could do for my country. What's but this what called? My country could do for you. The, the uh, complex kind unit. Of, what do you call the the ask the HOA? Ask the uh-huh. HOA, my friend. Yeah, and then they, they give you the runaround. That's what it is. Do you yeah. complain to your landlord? No. No. We don't do that. Yeah, my landlord is not to be messed with. To be trifled with. with. Mm. That's a shame. He'll yell at you. Yeah. Oh, wow. He'll blame you. You got to get out of here. My landlord. No, but he's broke. nice. Yeah. He's, he's, he's he'll take guy. care he's of you. He's a real sweet guy. Yeah. yeah. Real sweet guy. Yeah. He, uh. Is he like a father figure? Big time. Well, mm. he'll take care of you. I don't like know. a father, like a father to me. My landlord. Well, it just has the figure of a father. Cooked goose for everyone. Yeah. That's the thing. Yeah. He's like, um, yeah. What else kind, can we say? About him? Kind, sweetheart, is respectful. Broke my leg in three places. Really? But, uh, wow. Yeah, rent was late for two days. But hmm. what I mean, are you going to do? What are you going to do? You know? It's a great place. A great yeah. rent control department. Great smile. Great RCA. smile. Yeah. Did we say favorite Heck of board a bowler. game? Heck of a bowler. Yeah. How do you guys know that? Well, have you seen him bowl? <laughs> no. Okay. Oh, okay. I don't. <laughs> I wonder what his favorite board game is. Maybe it's Clue. It's not, not, not Clue. It's not Clue. That's for sure. No, no. He kept saying Mr. Mayonnaise. He kept saying you know, Mr. You know, Mr. Mayonnaise in the living room. He has no idea about Clue. He kept saying Mr. Mayonnaise in the living room with a baseball bat. <laughs> Actually, he wasn't talking about Clue at all. Check out the Mr. Moto movies from the 30s. What? Is that a thing? Cultural appropriation. Mr. Moto. Wait, Favorite if you're going to say game. that, then I'm going to say check out the Charlie Chan movies. Yes, Charlie Chan. <laughs> I think they... Mr. Moto. Made Mr. Moto because Charlie Chan had died? Or really? No, not, no, not Charlie Chan. <laughs> the director, I think, or something. I don't know. They're related somehow. They are. Favorite board game, Connect 4. Because I always win. <laughs> oh, we, we played a game of Connect Four together. Remember that famous photo? Big, yes. Big, wow. Big, big time rush. What? Big time <laughs> rush. It was one of those giant Connect uh, Fours. Uh, uh. Were we play, was dancing to that when we? No, I don't think there was music around. Well, then why are you playing that song? <laughs> big time. Is uh? Oh yeah. Does does <laughs> air hockey count as a yes. board game? I don't think, I think so. it should be a sport. It's a, it should it be should the, sport. No, because then can I tell you? Count as a board game. I think air hockey should be as a sport as curling is. 
I am. I would love to play curling. So would I. Let's go. Let's when it, it comes to air hockey, I am a, like a savant. And Nikki can attest to that. Huh? Nikki, you can attest. We have. When it comes to air hockey, I am like a savant. We have a knock hockey set. Do we still have it? I have a fresh, brand new board that I bought for like 80 bucks for my grandmother after my grandfather passed away. Because I was like, I want the legacy to live on, you know, to play at grandma's so I could feel mm-hmm. like a kid again. Mm-hmm. But like, grandma's like, don't put that on the floor. Uh, uh, uh. She gets a little like, you know. Oh, it's a floor? You have to play it on the floor? It's a knock hockey. It's, a, it's like the size of this table almost. Uh-huh. And you lay it down and you have two plastic, you know, you can use wood ones, but they give you two plastic sticks and a wood disc. Puck. And um, you lay it down and you take turns. Hit, 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 hit until you get it in the other person's goal. Pretty much like a hockey field. Uh, it's at my father's house. My dad's like, when you want it, just take it. It's just taking up space in my garage. So probably soon I'll just be like, I'm getting it out of here when I get the rest of my stuff from the house. That's what you and Felicia are going to play. Yeah. Wow. I would love to. I, I would love to even show you what it looks like next time. Okay. I'd love chance. to. It's a classic. It's classic. I don't know. Can we play on the table though? Yeah. You, you can even okay. two things. Cause it's a classic to be like a kid and sit on the carpet. We don't have carpet here. We sit on the carpet and just play it. Because my grandfather used to teach me like all the moves. Like you can use your hands if you want, but you get one motion you can just do. Like a one motion with your hand. With your better with your thumb, thumb. Or you can use the stick. Hmm. I've heard of it, but no, yeah. I've never played it. It's a you know classic like fifties thing. Yeah, you know you don't have board games which were sixties, seventies, or video games, or video games which are eighties to today. Everything's digital now. Yeah. But, so we're we are yeah. But you know, it's Reason. all about bringing bringing people together more so. Digital, digital. See, that's what I'm saying. The internet's down. What else are you gonna do? The hockey, hockey man. <laughs> So recently, Nikki was like, when you go, because, you know, I plan on moving to New York. Correct. Within the next, you know. And if this is someone's first time listening to Matzo Boys, you just found out Chris is planning to move to New York. Yeah, eventually. Within a reasonable amount of time. Um, And And whenever anyone's listening to this, you may already be up there. I may be. (laughs) Yes, I was going to say, too. (laughs) And if this is an old one. Yeah. If you're backlogging. Or then this is uh, farther yeah. in the future. And right now, Chris is we're, back. We're recording <laughs> from Florida. Yeah, and we're all together. <laughs> and if you're listening, very very far in the future, the world is over. But anyway, um, well, not right now, as we're, the world is still going on. But anyway, um, so he's like, "You're probably going to take your PlayStation too, because that was like the best system." Mm-hmm. You had, did you have a P- PlayStation 2? Of course. Everyone had a PlayStation 2. It was the best system. And I still play it. Like, it's it's hooked up in my room. Mm-hmm. And I'm like, yeah, I probably will. It's the best system. Like, I have all my, all my PlayStation 2 games. In fact, during the pandemic, like, I went through, like, eBay, Amazon, and Mercari, and I started buying up all the old games that were, like, cheap mm-hmm. that I enjoyed. And I would, like, buy them back for, like, $5, $10. And I was, like, playing through them. And um, he's like, when you leave, we should split, we should buy another PS2 and split it so that there's one here, you know, that I can have. And I was like, good idea. And I, he's like, or just have one so that when it dies, if mm-hmm. and when it dies, I go, yeah. these things will never die. Like, they're built so well. He's like, just take a look. Mm-hmm. And as I'm looking through Mercari, there's like stacks of like five of them. Someone's selling for like 10 bucks. And it says five PS2s, all bad car, all bad disc readers. Uh, this PS2, bad disc reader. This PS2, bad disc reader. Mm-hmm. The eye keeps going bad on all of them, and I go, oh. and I start getting all nervous. Mm-hmm. I was like, oh my goodness, I really have to buy one. Mm-hmm. So me and Nikki just ended up purchasing one, and we just it just came like two or three days ago. So now we have a second PlayStation Two. Yeah, and what's funny about this, because Nick did tell me right before uh, we started recording this, is that I have two PS2s. Really? Yeah. Oh, you should have told me. should have told me. I would have just 
giving you the other one. No, oh, I'll buy it off of you. No, you already get two. You have three. We're gonna we're uh, connoisseurs of electronic mm-hmm. devices. No, I mean you don't mm-hmm. have to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. PS2 do is do PS2 it? is the. Uh, is it a slim or it's a chubby? Is the um, the brick? Yeah, it's the it's the, the chubby one. Yeah. yeah, yeah. PS2 is is by far the best. Yeah, yeah. Way better than PS3. I will say PS4 was better than PS3. Really? I think, I think so. so. Yeah, it made a big jump. Yeah, I like. I still enjoy my PS3. Because PS4 compound compiles all of the PS3 games. Really? Can you play PS3 games on the PS4? Yeah, I don't think you can. Well, maybe with some. Well, no. I don't know. What do I know? I got a PS3 like four years after it came <laughs> well, yeah. out. I was very excited. There's always a uh, what's it called a back uh, backwards compatibility with stuff. No, yeah. not always. But PS3 is. Uh, I mean PS2. Excuse me. PS2 is is the best yeah. system out there. I so I'm still playing it now. Yeah, and I, I'm getting some old games too. Go on uh, Merc- yeah, get them all on Mercari. Yeah, they're sponsor this episode. Yeah, and Fresca. We can't forget about Fresca. The cool, yeah. crisp taste of a taste, taste. of uh, Fresca on a hot summer day like today. <laughs> we'll uh, always get you where yeah. you need to go. Yesterday, not so hot, but... Yeah, but today... Woo! Thank you, Fresca. <sighs> did you hear... Did I ever tell you about that time with the... Um... The Frenchman, the Englishman, and the Jew? No. No? No. Mm. So, they've all been arrested. And oh. they're about to be uh, sentenced to death. But they say to them, they're like, you can pick the way that you would like to die. Mm. So the Frenchman picks the guillotine. So they build... A guillotine and they execute him that way hmm. the Englishman says the firing squad so they get you know people together and the, the squad mm-hmm. the squad pulls up and then he he's executed that way and then uh, they go over to the Jew and they ask him how he would like to die and he said this has been Matzo Voice. Oh, oh, you, you know. <laughs> so then they go to the go over to the Jew and they, they ask him uh, how he would like to be executed, how he would like to die. Right. And the Jew says, old age. Ah. Uh, that's a good choice. Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs>